Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Will, and we are back with some more Nino Kuni tonight. So, we just got back from the other world, and we were about to run and find the sage, i say, with his daughter. Since we helped them over in the other world. Ah. Not like eyelash. I have an eyelash situation. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah, we just got back in. Uh, we've already done all the side quests available to us right now. I believe. I believe we did. Oh, let's double check that. Alright, yeah. We already did all of them. Got it. Let's uh, move on. Main store time. Ooh, yakacha. And this dude's supposed to be like one of the four sages. Like, how does he not know how to fix his daughter? It's like a pretty basic thing. I mean, a child can do it and is literally doing it. All right, let's give the heart component. What one did we get? I think it was Courage we got from her. Okay. Yeah, what would happen if we gave her the wrong component? What is this? Where am I? What happened? It was Shadar. He stole a piece of your heart. My heart? Is it you, Esther? Is it really you? Oh, my dear daughter. Father. Oh, forgive me, my child. <laughs> Yay. You were robbed of your courage. But I... I have only myself to blame for the loss of my own. Oliver, it is you who taught me this. You have my thanks. You're welcome, Mr. Ashad. I will join you in the fight against Shudar. The day will soon come when the clarion rings out across the land once more. The clarion? Oh, it's an old story from way back, that is. Back when the world was at peace, like. The three kings of our world combined their skills and knowledge to create a flute that symbolized the great peace. The sound of this flute came to represent the unity of the nations of the world. How long is it now since the call of the clarion was heard? Not since the three kings got into a right old potch and fell out, I heard. It's up to us. The clarion will ring out again and we will be the ones to play it. <laughs> Very well, daughter. Let us do our best. Let us help Oliver in his fight. Thank you so much, Mr. Ashad, sir. Budgy bird. Nice. Booyah. Up its string.
Okay, that, out of all of them, I'd say that's the one that I probably know what it does. Assuming that's just, you know. Boy, he has, like, his cup runneth over with these magic spells he'd be throwing at us. Noise. All right. Now we have a uh, four new spells that we're gonna have to learn. I'm pretty sure one of them is just like a light, so we'll probably be going into a dungeon. Wait, no, no, it's a cart for... Plus, we got a new person. I wonder how their fighting style is gonna be. Because our main boy, he's like... He's a magician, so it's like weak at actually doing physical combat. So I'm wondering if she's gonna be strong doing physical combat. Okay, sweet, so we got that. I assume... Oh, hello. Oh, it's Ghost Boy. Oh yeah, he said we'd meet at a fountain. I was just thinking about him. Uh, let's... let's uh, what was it called? Okay, Puppet Strings, what does this do? Huh. That's... What would we use that on? Okay, spring lock. We already had magical lamp. Okay, yep, that one's obvious. So interesting. Spirit medium is what we need for this situation. Is that why this place smells of rancid cheese? Because all of the milk everywhere? Ugh. We're in the hot desert and they have milk fountains. Do you know how bad that would smell?
Okay, so we're probably gonna find all the sages. I'm pretty sure our mom is one of them. We just met and companioned up with another, so there's two more sages to find that we don't know what they look like. So I'll have to do that. Let's, uh, back to this guy. All right. Yeah, a lot of these quests are like three to four stars. Actually, do we do we already have some that we could give him? Alright. So we have that to do. Um the over here is there. There's another one over here. Okay, we just picked up kindness. We can already just solve this one. Okay. Yeah, I find it kind of weird that like when you're assigned a mission to like give someone a heart piece, you have to re-talk to them to give it to them, opposed to just like get the mission and then just cast the spell right away on your own terms rather than having to re-talk to them. A lot of cups of coffee here. Hey, all right. I keep on hitting the wrong button to um, look into containers. Every time I start playing this game, I always hit the wrong one. All right, let's uh, look at our book. This, I believe, was the story. Sorry, this is probably going to be boring. <laughs> Wait, let's let's talk to him and see what kind of information he needs to see if we could just skim it. Oh, what? This isn't just a... 
what, what do I... Who's the smallest? Do I just go... Can I just go... West? Whoa, there's a lot. Holy hell. Okay. Oh my god, random shot in the dark. Weird that they have you type it out and it's just not a multiple choice. That's super weird decision. Okay, um... Oh, sweet! We get rewards for it. Draw poison. Okay, this probably recover allows us to recover from poison. Oh, okay, so that's it? I thought he'd ask us multiple questions or something. Oh, okay. Seafront Town will be the next place we'll probably see him, I'm assuming. Now let's go out and do some fights with our new uh, character. Um, let's see, what level are they? They're level 10, okay, they're five levels below us. Yeah, but I can't believe I got that. I was just a random shot in the dark with that uh, question he asked us. Lucky. I just wanted to test to see like how we actually answer it, if we had to like spell the whole thing out or what. I think we already have courage. We? Oh no, that's courage. And wait, what's the one that we have already? Shoot. Yeah. Now we're just running and hitting all these people as we're trying to get out of town. Maybe enthusiasm, that's what the one that we have is.
Alright. Yeah, these ones are pretty easy. Since we pick up every single emotion that we can. Along the way. Two sandwiches! I measure my wealth in sandwiches, not in gold. Alright, come on, let's, uh... Let me pop on through that. Alright, let's check in here, see if there's any bounties or anything that we can do when we're, as we're going out. Oh, boy! Milk chocolate. Flame robe, hello. I'm grabbing all of them. In Northern Shimmering Sands. Right for that one. Alright, and then I don't think this is any different, right? Wait, what does this guy want? I was skipping past it because I thought it was just finishing up. Alright, I don't remember what this person down here was selling. I didn't know they had quite a few goods that we haven't gotten yet. Someone did. In terms of food. Got one Phoenix Feather. Alright, let's see, um... The map. Okay, so there's... One more person over near the hotel. Really? I could have sworn it would have been that guy. That's weird. Alright. Okay, this guy needs another emotion. Give them the courage. The courage you need, dear boy.
Yeah, see, quests of giving people the emotions are pretty easy since I normally pick them up already. Actually, I wonder... Should I... I need to test out gating over to the other world without it being part of the main story. This is all western. It said I need to go to the northern. Oh. Blue dot way over there. And way up there. And over there. Okay. We're going to be exploring some of these blue dots. This is going to be a tutorial situation. Oh, she's a bard. Damn it. Assuming Shipper Tomb. Oh, okay, so that's a heal. Alright, let's summon her familiar, see how this goes. Whoa, that's a big heal. Whoa, her familiar is pretty kick-ass. Strong heals that seem like a strong thunder attack. And they're only level 10. God damn it, really? I just buy the bananas because we didn't have any, and then I just pick one up. Really? Ridiculous. Alright, so we could swap familiars. Let's just do a couple quick fights. Try to level them up. Come on, you guys! Oh, I wasn't paying attention that I still needed to do the thingy. Oh, so they can collect the uh, green and blue orbs as well when you're not playing as them. Oh, Emberstone. Cream milk. God damn it, I shouldn't have bought those foods. Because now we're just getting them. All 
Remember, we're heading towards the blue marker up north. Let's do it! Oh, well, my MP is super low. What the hell did... What the hell is the AI doing when I was controlling Esther? <laughs> is it like wiped out my MP? Alright, we can't go in. It's a sand trap, not a real big surprise. The cook sand, really. Here we go! Can I do healing touch? Okay, that's not good. I'm wondering if this is playing by like old school RPG rules where we have to like sleep at an inn for them to come back to life. Or no, okay, they're good, they're good. Um, we're gonna do healing touch. Everyone. Oh, I wasted one. Shoot, I hit it one too many times. Although I'm not a big fan that the dad's with us, but he's not like actually doing anything. Oh, okay. Special, special type. Damn, she's already taken out. I just... Wow. Crap. I, we're in, against an invisible wall. Yeah, I'm gonna have to adjust the uh, AI on the other person. I just did like all out, like go all out. But apparently that is definitely not what you want to do because they are way too weak. All right, that's for the bounty hunt. I'm gonna try to do more fights just so we can level up the other characters. Oh, there we go. It did a heal automatically. That's nice. Okay, tactics. Give it your all. Um... Okay, let's go keep us healed and see how that goes. I hope they heal themselves as well. Oh, all right. Let's see having her be the healer goes.
Alright, let's check. Okay, so we're gonna want to go to that temple, I'm assuming. Uh, we're gonna run over and hit that other blue marker first. Oh, I think that little lampshade guy's new. Seems like Mr. Drippy really isn't throwing out that much anymore. Alright, nice. Okay, she's all up on her heels now that she's leveled up. Oh, Naruto running tiger. I see him. That's who we need to take on. I like how they have you, like, with bounties. You have to choose to fight them instead of accidentally running into them. Oh my gosh, he's taken out already? I'm done for! I'm done for! Ah! Invisible wall! Damn you! I just can't tell when I'm running into it. Alright, uh, regular coffee restores 30. Yeah, I set her to heal, but it seems like she wasn't even healing at all. She was just attacking. my god. Oh, we had attack up. That's why. Okay, we are not strong enough to fight this dude. We're gonna have to gain a few levels. Or at the very least, have our partner to be able to survive. Okay, okay, we're good. I was afraid that we'd lose the other bounty, but no, we we kept that. Um, let's head back into town and collect the bounty. Oh, and I could probably... No, I got nothing for them. Let's uh, check in here, see if we can buy any armor or anything for them. Oh, wait, 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 let's, uh, let's turn in our bounty first, see what we can get, and then do that. Because I don't want to get something from here that will make, like, the armor obsolete or anything. Flame Bunty. Oh, Bone Shield, hell yeah, nice. And we needed three, st yeah, shoot, we needed three stamps, not All right, let's see here. Whoa! Going from three to ten, hell yeah. Yeah, I can't tell, like... It seems like everyone else needs, like, like clothing while our little knight guy only needs a shield.
But yeah, I wanted to try going over to the our other world and see if we could buy food from there and bring it here. Because maybe that will be like for one of the quests. Oh yeah, I'll buy that. That will definitely boost up our uh, new familiar. And she does not have any weapon. Expensive. All right, that hurt. That hurt buying all that. <laughs> all right, let's add the spear to them. Really boosts their strength up. Then we'll add this to her. And I don't know. This seemed like this would be. gonna head over towards the uh, left side over near the fairy forest because there's a blue dot over there plus I believe we have to go to the fairy forest for one of the quests as well yeah we haven't went to the castle in um La Moon. so hopefully we'll be able to go there as well I haven't really tried I don't think I've tried no, I did try. I wasn't able to go in. I'm assuming that would be a story part where we'll end up going there. And hopefully the a the creatures will be a little bit weaker on this side of the map. Got the health. A booyah. Oh, hell yeah, two level ups. Nice. Let's do it. Right, I'm going to try to bring out the little wizard guy. Okay, so he um, Esther is healing us from the sidelines because uh, this little purple familiar guy, well, blue, blue and purple familiar, was being healed up, and I wasn't doing any healing. Oh um, yeah, Oliver gained another level. Destroyed him so quickly. Yeah. 
I believe the blue marker was past the forest. Surprise! A murderous surprise. That shall be your downfall. There it is. Uh. Here we go. Lumberwood. All of these have been super easy for, except for the tig that one tiger. Good lord. Mushroom. Alright, let's check the forest. I thought the uh, guy that wanted us to get the spice said that someone here. Actually, we never did go re-look at that tree. Maybe there's something there. And I also want to see if that puppeting move maybe can move that treasure chest that's up on the ledge. Here. Maybe try to move it down. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have anything to unlock that yet, still. Is up with the tree. Stay oh wait, what am I doing? I'm fighting with Oliver. Get no. <laughs> All right, now let's do this. Alright, there we go. I keep forgetting that when we get uh, snuck up on, we're like default fighting with Oliver. Oh. Never got that item before. I just wanted to check to make sure there was no other biz happening with this tree. Oh yeah, there was also that uh, robot here too. Oh, that's what we could use the puppet on. Let's go. Maybe if we use the puppet on that giant uh, rock golem, we'll move around. Easy. 
There you go, quackers. Just need to remember where he was. I'm pretty sure he was like right near the front area. Alright, let's see. Can we cast a spell? Figure out how to get that one one day. <laughs> Stay calm now. Here goes. Noise. I think it's over here and up the mushrooms on our left, I think. I'm assuming it's because we're high enough level that certain monsters are just running away now. I don't even know. Are they running away or are they just running in a specific direction? Random go. direction. Every so often I catch myself just waiting for my character to attack when like the attack phase is over for him and I have to reselect. I keep doing that. It's a terrible habit. Yay, two levels. Alright, let's see if this works. That, that should work! Come on! No, man, come on. Puppeting, that should work! Damn it! Alright. Then what do I need for this? Hold on, I'm checking something. Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay, figuring that out. Um... up the forest robot just to see how do I help him okay um I'm looking up how to um, open purple chests just to make sure that it's another lock spell 
And it's not some, like, other random-ass spell that I already have. Oh, I think it, it looks like we level up our, our move, our uh, spell lock, or a spring lock. Okay, so it's going to be the same one, we're just going to need to level it up by uh, main story shenanigans. All right. So, this was kind of useless coming here, unfortunately. Um, actually, let me see. How do I move the forest treasure chest? Let's see if there's a way to do it right now. What? Alright, um... It's sane to get it? You just need to, like, stand close to it and open it. Come on! So weird. I don't have to knock down that treasure chest from that, um, ledge. You just have to, like, be really close and cast it. Weird. I don't know if they're talking about the same one that I'm thinking of, but we'll try it. It says, stand almost to the tree. Yeah, what tree? They said tree. What? can't be right. Alright, let me check around. Damn it, I keep jumping on the mushrooms. I'm not understanding it. People are saying that you just need to like line yourself up with it. Just like what you talking about, Willis? This can't no. figure this out. There's... So, yeah, I've been seeing comments saying that there is a way to get it. Oh, 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 okay. I see what the problem is. People are... The wrong forest. Shoot. Oh, ah! There is that small forest village off to the right of Ding Dong Dell. And people were talking about that one. Shoot.
Okay, that's... Alright, I was just putting in the forest, but I'm gonna put in the specific name. I'm an idiot. Should've done that right off the bat. Oh, okay. It looks like we have to get another person in our party to be able to unlock that one then. Okay. Yeah, figured it out. Okay, so I do know that there is one more person that joins our party at least, and that they have a gun. So apparently they do like a a shot or something that they can do to unlock treasure chests. So apparently that's what we need to do. Those. I honestly thought it would just be some sort of spell with Oliver. Alright, we're just gonna save super quick. And I'm an idiot. The spice guy we're supposed to talk to is in the town. It was the guy that we, uh, gave, what was it, courage to? That he was talking about spices. I thought that was a separate quest. I'm dumb. Alright. And I didn't pay attention to really what he said because I was just, uh... I was just trying to do the first part of the quest, which was uh, giving him piece of the heart. And I was going to come back for that other part of the quest, but it looks like... It was actually... Those two quests were just one quest, so... Gonna run on back. We are going to fight some more people in the desert, try to level up a little bit more. Gaddy. Oh, oh, I should use water bomb on the tiger for the bounty. Keeping your distance, plus that seems to do a lot of damage to him. Cats famously don't like water. Oh, that could be a thing. But yeah, kind of irresponsible. You know, adult sage who's supposed to be like, you know, really adept with magic. What not. Letting the kids fight. Good call. Don't worry, we're like what? 11, 12, maybe? We can handle murderous creatures. Ah, fireball. Do Naruto run at me, boy. I was just gonna say, why isn't she pulling out her familiar? Got it. Got a little health ball there at the end. Plus, with that bounty we did over near the uh, Golden Forest, we should have enough stamps now to get the next card.
All right, this guy was naming off some recipe bits. Got that. Spicy seeds, I don't know if we have. Okay, yeah, we got that one. Okay, so we have to go to the Great Volcano for that one. Alright, alright. Got it, got it. Yeah, I was just kind of whizzing past those because I thought that was like a completely separate quest thing. Boom. Give me that hot milk chocolate. God, why are these starting to look more and more plain? What do you have against? Oh wait, actually that's such check rewards. I believe that's two points. Ooh, that'd be good. Alright, let's do this. This seems like that would be a lot more helpful. Alright, and let's go to the volcano so we can get those bits. The spicy bits. I didn't think they had anything marked at the volcano, but I could be wrong. Let's uh, check it to check it. Yeah, there's nothing over near the volcano. Because at least with the uh, the roots that we got, if that was marked on our map. Yeah, I wonder what the percentage boost is for healing orbs to show up now. I shift you something good. Nice, another level up. Wow, she's really fallen behind here. Gotcha, bananas. We're about to be smashed. We can do this. The banana monster just uppercutted me. Oh my god. <laughs> nice I'm sorry, I got really low energy today, guys. Gas bot. Let's uh, move on. Yep. Yeah, I got woken up hella early this morning by my neighbors. And could not get any sleep. So I'm a little out of it at the moment. Ooh, hello. Oh, let's do water. It's, uh... Boom. Double teaming them with magician people. Nice Little lightning water combo.
Alright, I'm thinking up there maybe will be the seeds that we need. Okay, a little bit of a lazy design, but uh, whatever. Boom. Bust in the cap. Okay, yeah, they're really throwing out a lot more green. That's good. Oh, she's almost got another level. Oh, we got the seeds. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Nice two levels out of it. I'm gonna try to get this. I was thinking maybe we could rewind it before the lava was like hot or whatever. Or like before the lava like ran down. God damn, there's like so many. So many peoples. Oh, what's this dude? Small fry? Be rice. Yeah, magic is kind of OP, I think, in this, maybe. Nice we'll see. Although it does have a cooldown. What does the Ember Stone do? Like, we've been getting some of those, but I don't know what they're for.
God, we've been dodging all of these fools. As I say that. Ah, oh, come on, he was over the sand dune. <laughs> you bastards. It's going too good, son. God, did he just pop out three different heal balls? That's crazy. Yum, yum, yum. Bananas. Bananas. Alright, we should have everything for the spice. Spice melange. Oh, hello. 15 gold, we're rolling in it. What are you talking about? We got all of it. What the hey? The roots and the seeds. Yeah, we got it. All right, let's go talk to the other guy. Maybe he has something to say once we, ha because we have all of them. Oh my God! No one's manning the banana stand. Who there? Curry man. I'm not understanding. What's happening here? Am I having a stroke? What's going on? We have the stuff. Was there... Oh, god damn it. Don't tell me there were more seeds that I missed. Or something. Or maybe there's another root I'm supposed to get. Oh! Three pinches of seeds. God damn it, there was a third seed somewhere. Ah. All right, so we need to get one more seed. Damn it. Uh, you know what? Let's let's try the gate spell right now and see it. Gate away. I want to see what we can interact with in the other world. I don't like how... Yeah, like, nothing really shows up on this map. Um, can we buy stuff? I want to see... What are our options? Ah, the store sucks. You can't buy anything. Nice looking store. My house tire shop. Yeah, this place is just so like there's nowhere to really go. Like they have all these beautiful shops, but like you can't go or interact with any of them really. Darn it. That's I think that's the biggest downfall. Is that this town looks so beautiful, but you don't really have too much to do in it. Um, let's see if we can go inside our house and if there's anything there for us. I don't know. Fireball. Nope. All right. And I'm a big fan of, like, open-world RPGs, where it's like, you can explore this whole world, it's like, cool, there's nothing really in it. 
like darn it like yeah they're giving us side quests but they're like super localized to the area that you're in We're not getting anything out of here, so let's skate back. Ah, she knows. Yeah, because unfortunately, we're getting none, yeah. Um, let's do a gra grab a quick sleep, and then we'll head out. Try to do that bounty again, and then we'll continue with the main story, and we'll come back to the volcano. Its movement on the large map is a bit slow. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> Yeah, and I've also noticed there's not really anything out here for us to pick up either. Because around Ding Dong Dell, there were at least things to um, pick up. Oh, hello! Pathway up to the ledge. Yes, please. Up here. Oh! New owl type enemy, as well as you know. Okay, wow, they're actually doing quite a bit of dam. Wow, they're doing quite a bit of damage. Oh shit! No, it does not end here. God, we just slept and we're already getting shanghaied by these butt pirates. Ah! Yes. Oh, it counted, yes! Oh, hey, we're finally hitting the limit of a sandwich. God, yeah, we're only doing like three damage. Budge. Ah! Damage give me strength! Spell, uh... A pulse. Damage a single enemy. Whoa, nice.
Ah! Damn it, sandwich. God damn, these boys are tough as hell. Oh crap, we're all out of uh, magic. God damn, so weak. Boom, oh my god. We better get so much XP from that, oh my god. We really shit the bed on that one, oh my god. Oh, and it wasn't that much either. Oh, God. Eh, but we got one sandwich back. At least there's that. Good Lord. All right, where are we map-wise? All right, this looks like it's kind of a dead end up here if you go that way. Shoot, we have to, like, return to the town and get healed up. I'm gonna spend another 20 to sleep. God, we are so boned. Oh god, and there's enemies everywhere, of course. Um Yep, turn around, keep walking, keep walking, don't see us, don't see us. Yeah, we were gonna go after the bounty until all this shenanigans happened. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh god. Yeah, everyone was dead. Nothing was good. <laughs> We're gonna sleep again. We're gonna look at getting some more sandwiches. The bread is so useless. I find it so laughable that is, that, that is even an item in this game. Because even when we were like level 5, bread was like borderline useless. <laughs> Actually, I didn't even use bread until I hit, like, level 10, and then I used it, and I'm like, oh, that replaces, like, nothing. Stay hydrated. Laban. Yeah, we have one, uh, Phoenix Feather. We are not using it on some just rando encounter. Right, I believe the old lady has... I think she has like healing items. And gold. Yeah, at least these little pots around town can give you back, like, the money you spend on, um, the inn, at least. Pretty close, too. You there, shopkeep! What have we got? Ah! Of course you don't sell sandwich. You only sell bread. Alright, this time no shenanigans. We're heading straight towards the bounty. And if we don't get it this time, we'll just continue with the story. And go to the uh, temple, I think it was. Oh, come on, banana guy. Alright, we're good, we're good. Yeah, that's the temple we need to go to. Where is he? There he is. He's right over there running around like a maniac. No, no, no. No, no, no. Hey, guy. 
fight me. <laughs> We're gonna try to stay far away and use magic on him. Come on, you guys. Actually, you know what? Let's Oliver and we'll use uh Nice! Alright. Oh my god, we are destroying him with magic! Oh my god. Boom! Oh my god, last time she died almost immediately. And I, like, struggled to survive. <laughs> nice. Nice. Bounty complete. There's just so many enemies over here in this corner. And in fact, it looks like we might be able to get up on this ledge. Yeah, run away, run away, little lampshade. All right. Yeah, and there's nothing. Okay, I wasn't sure if maybe in one of the corners there was a uh, item or something. Looks like there was not. All right. That dude up there, lanky motherfucker. <laughs> bad banana, bad banana. Don't turn around, don't turn around. Go, 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 go. Damn you. Okay, we can make it, we can make it, we can make it. Temple of Trials. Get your mana. I need to play that, uh, the Mana series. I've not, I know, like, was it the first and second, or was it the second and third that just got remade? But anyway, there's some remakes coming out for, that have been out for them that I've wanted to try. Esther, why did you set out on this journey in the first place? Most people wouldn't dream of taking on someone like Shadar. Well, uh, it's my mom. I have to save her. Your mother? Uh, yeah. She, she died saving my life. But Mr. Drippy says there's a way to help her here in this world. So, you've come here to save your mother? Yeah, I guess. Wow. Huh? Doing all this for the sake of someone you love? I just think that's amazing. I wish I had as good a reason as you for making this journey. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean I wish that... It's okay. But... Shadar is incredibly powerful. He breaks the hearts of anyone who defies him. So no one dares to resist. And they say no one can defeat him. I know that. But... I have to. You have to try, right? I... yeah. It's so strange. You don't look powerful in the least. But somehow, I just know you can beat him. I wonder why. Thanks. Anyway, enough of that. It's late. Okay. Oh, Banana Boy, hell no. He's all up on our buns.
Oh, alright, I was thinking maybe there'd be something behind it. I look more doofy than I thought. Uh, we, uh... So this is the Supreme Sage, is it? Ahem. <clears throat> Your Honor, we have come to perform the trials. Not... me. Huh? huh? Idiots! Oh. I'm the Supreme Sage! Whoa! Oh. That's just my stupid servant, Umboka! Hey, the face, the uh, symbol on the chest looks like those uh, plates near the save point. Well, to be fair, like, you did just meet, like, the, the sage guy did just meet Oliver's. So, like, really? You don't want to adventure a little or something with him to figure out, like, he's actually worthy or something? And we just didn't get insanely lucky with helping you? <laughs> Be fair, he wasn't even really helping us out in the field while we were coming here, so it's like, whatever. Not 
like we had a huge journey. Yeah, yeah, it's the same symbol. Oh, uh, once we... Oh. Okay, so... Okay, it's either going to be a teleporter or a shop, and I'm assuming it gets unlocked once we complete this. Alright. This is probably going to be a really in-depth thing, if I had to guess. So, um, we are almost at time right now. So I don't want to get started on this if it's going to take us like 30 to 40 minutes to do. I don't know how long it's going to be, so I'm just guessing ballpark that, that that's how long it's going to be. So, we're going to call it here for today. And then on Wednesday, we will pick up right here and continue this right away. And we'll figure out what the hell these things do. <laughs> uh, part of me wants there to be a shop. But then another part of me is like a teleporter would be helpful. But uh, we will see. And uh, yeah. That uh, is going to be it. For today guys thank you very much everyone for coming out and hanging out i really appreciate it. if you hit that follow button it really helps me out and if you want to see any of my past streams they're all over on my youtube channel the link is down below for that as well as a link over to my twitter where i tweet out every day when i'm online and what i am playing tomorrow we are going to be doing some genshin impact we're going to be continuing exploring maybe actually starting up the next section of main story quests uh, we'll see. We There is an event going on, so we'll, we'll definitely do the event stuff. We'll see how long that takes. Actually, yeah, the last event stuff did take a while. Maybe we'll just do the event tomorrow. But we're going to talk about the stream that happened over the weekend, talking about the 2.2 update and the new characters, events, and island that they're going to be adding into the game. Uh, and yeah, we're going to talk about all that biz tomorrow. Wednesday, we're going to be getting back into Nino Kuni, so... Hopefully, I will see you guys tomorrow with some Genshin Impact. If not, I will see you guys back here on Wednesday with more Nino Kumi. And that is it for day 398 of streaming in a row. See ya. Bye-bye.